Hello traders, FX Pip Collector here. Today is Thursday, February 16th, and I'm going to be analyzing the Aussie US dollar starting on the monthly, working my way down to the one hour time frame. So on the monthly, as you can see, we've definitely been going up very strong. It still looks to me like we have three waves up and then three waves down. Usually that will actually lead to another three-way pattern up, which may or may not take out the higher this previous ABC before it makes another attempt to continue the downtrend. So let's head down to the weekly time frame. Weekly time frame, I definitely already see a three-way pattern here, so we definitely got to keep that in mind. And this very easily could just keep on going down from there. But, looking at the US dollar DXY, it still makes me think that this is actually going to be an A, B, C, probably a B. And back up again for wave C, like I was showing on the monthly. Probably an A, B, and C before it ends up making another push to the downside. So, let's head down to the daily. Daily time frame, it definitely, if this is a wave A, which it does look like it is, then this should be a 1, 2, and we should be in a wave 3, 4, 5 of wave A. Eventually going up to make a B, and then down again to make a wave C. Should be an A, B, C of B, if it follows what I think will happen on the US dollar, DXY. So, let's head down to the 4 hour time frame. 4 hour time frame is where you can actually start to see that this is a trend back here, series of lower lows, lower highs. I still think it's possible this is a 1. This looks like 3 waves up, 3 waves down, and then 3 waves up again, making what I think is a WXY pattern. Definitely respected the 50%, made a nice impulsive move down. This move up is probably going to be a crutch into that last move down, and I bet it will end up continuing the downtrend. Maybe even the end of a wave 2 and the beginning of a wave 3. So let's head down to the one hour time frame. One hour time frame, you can start to see this trend. One, two, three, four, five. It already made three ways up right here, so we have to keep an eye on this. It's at the 38%. If it turns down, takes out Strutzer, that's pretty much going to prove to me that the wave C is already over, and I will definitely be ready to go sort for the continuation of the downtrend. It's probably going to be a one, A, B, C of two, and then go down for that wave 3, which should be a wave 3 of 3, which is a wave 3 of wave A. So, don't forget to join my free Discord channel. The link for that is on the screen and in the description. Thanks, and happy trading.